Hi guys, it's Connie Jo with Perfectly Posh and last week on Facebook I posted that I got my November Ipsy Glam Bag and then I've had several people say, so what'd you get, what'd you get? And I have been so busy that really I just kind of glanced in it and that's it. I haven't really even pulled out the stuff to see what it is. So we are going to see what it is together. Um, so the very first thing that I have is... Let me show you the bag first. So it's um, a navy uh, bag and then it kind of feels a little padded too, which is always nice, especially um, if you have your makeup in the heat or anything. I, I mean, it's not insulated, but anyway. And then it has gold on it. I always like the gold. It makes it look kind of classy. And then it looks like it has like makeup brush and a lip gloss and lipstick. Um, Anyway, it's cute. Not as cute as the October bag, but it's cute. So, anyway, first thing is I have a um, banana highlighting powder. So, it comes in, it's just a sample, and it comes like this, and then I, it comes out. And this is metal, so some of them, they come in like paper, but this didn't. And it's banana. It's like a really light yellow. It definitely has a yellow tint to it though. Um, so that's highlighting powder. And um, anyway, it's Ofra. Ofra, I think is how you say it. I don't know. I don't do a whole lot of highlighting um, just because I don't know what I'm doing when I do any of that stuff. Um, I'm kind of clueless. I don't do the highlighting, I don't do the contouring, any of that. Uh, anyway, so first thing, um, banana highlighting. Okay, the next thing is, let's do this one. This one says, um, Free Matic Blush from du Duce? I don't know, du Duce. I don't <laughs> I'm not good with names, especially when they're fancy names. Um, anyway, it says Zen Orange is the color. Zen Orange. But it's not, not, not horrible orange, but um, a little bit orange. So it's... I'll probably try it. It's not horrible. Oh, it slides. The little, little lid slides. It looks like maybe it has, it fits, maybe it even magnetizes, I don't know, maybe it fits in something. It looks, kind of looks like the bottom of my camera thing, <laughs> but it doesn't fit in a camera thing, I'm sure. Anyway, so that's um, Dolce. I think I got their mascara one time in an Ipsy bag. I don't know, I'd have to look and see, but that sounds familiar. Um, and it was nothing to write home about, but it was okay. Um, I think it was the wand I didn't love, but anyway, speaking of mascara, here's a mascara. I love when I get mascaras because then they're small and um, you can replace them often and you get to try new ones. So, oh, that's cool. Look, it just pops off. I went to twist it and you don't twist it. It just says pull cap to open. I should have read that. Um, but it's called Mad Lash Black Mascara from The Balm. Um, instead of the bomb, the bomb has a curved brush, see, curved brush, and um, yeah, I'm excited to try that. I always like to try new mascaras, um, and like I said, it's a sample size. I like those because um, you can always try new things. I just got a bunch of sample size from Ulta the other day, a couple of my favorites. So um, this one is a brow wand from Scorn S K. Oh no, there's no R in that. Scone. Scone. S-K-O-N-E. Maybe? Scone? I'm assuming. Um, anyway, it's a brow wand um, eye pencil. So, one end is the brush. The other end is... Oh, that's kind of cool. So, it's, um, it's not even circle. <laughs> my kitty's meowing at my feet. It's... Um, it's kind of triangle. Can you see that? Probably not. I'm trying. But anyway, that's kind of cool. I'm excited to try that. It's a good, it's a good color for me. It's a chocolate. Chocolate. Um, and 
brow wand. Oh yeah, I said who it was from. And the very last one is N-U-X-E. I don't know what that is. Um, it says detox, um, detoxifying and youth revealing anti-aging care. Um, soothes and regenerates, revives dull complexion. So it sounds like um, some of the good stuff that Posh sells. Um, so I don't, I don't, I'm assuming, oh, it's, it's not black. <laughs> so it um, doesn't have charcoal in it, so it must detox with something else other than charcoal. Um, doesn't really have much of a smell um, or a scent to it. Um, anyway, I'm excited to try that. I'm always in need of anti-aging and um, rejuvenating. Uh, I'll have to read this and see what you actually do with it if you put it on before you go to bed or if you do it before you um, put on makeup. They always have such teeny tiny writing I can't ever see, but so I'll have to get my glasses out and actually read this. I'm getting old, so. Anyway, so that is my November Ipsy Clam bag with all sorts of fun things in it. I'm excited to try. Um, I'll post my link so you can um, sign up for Ipsy Glam Bag if you haven't yet. Um, I really enjoy it because then you can get some fun things that you may or may not like and that you haven't tried before. Um, last month in October, I got some liquid lipstick um, from a company called Cosmoholics. And I just got today my order from them because I loved it so much I bought some and I really liked it so I bought it and then this was a complete surprise to me I like took the lip gloss or it's a lipstick liquid lipstick I took the lipstick looking lip gloss looking thing off and there is a light so it was kind of cool a light turned on and so I can put my oh and then there's a mirror on the back too so I can put my lipstick on even in the dark <laughs> kind of cool anyway Thanks for watching, and again, Ipsy Glam Bag.